will transform your home into a lux luxurious oasis that you've always dreamed of with the help of a local interior designer. Kevin is live in Sacramento learning a little bit more. And Jor Jordan had that question about the tile, yeah. the back tile. Oh yeah, definitely. We're going to get to that um, because isn't that gorgeous? But yeah, Elizabeth with Elizabeth C Style Interiors. Okay, so we showed you this beautiful pool, ho pool house and behind it with the brightness and the colors, but now you can turn this into a work from home space. So Elizabeth, you're going to tell us about some essentials that you need to work from home and be productive and effectively, but again, with very simple stuff, right? So tell us a little bit about this. Oh yeah, it's very simple. So for me, I like to travel around when I'm working. I kind of like work in different spots throughout the house so this having a portable little desk is so great mm -hmm. and it has this little cushy thing on the bottom yeah, I love which is that. awesome um, and then I throw everything into this bag mm -hmm. and it's literally the easiest thing ever and that way you know when your bag comes out depending on what you do obviously you have a lot more stuff mm -hmm. but um, depending on what you do but you bring the bag out and it's time to work it's yeah. time to get to work turn the lights on set the mood and Absolutely. get going um, and of course, staying hydrated is always important, right? Oh yeah, you gotta stay hydrated. Try to meal prep so you get your proper nutrition. Oh, those are exactly. those are great tips. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Now, one of the things that um, I asked you during the commercial break is, so when you're working from home, do you feel like it's important? I mean, if you have the luxury of having your windows open, having the doors open like here, I mean, do you feel like that's important? Oh, absolutely. That's something I always do right away when I wake up in the morning. Just let as much light in as possible mm -hmm. and really just get that boost of light absolutely okay so let's get up because um so again and by the way really quickly as you mentioned that bag right there so all of this stuff can fit in that little bag and then you can just kind of grab and go and, and work from anywhere as you please like you said now um let's talk about mood boosters because you said mood boosters are so important when you're working from home right so important i think we kind of get in our own little world and we're kind of isolated mm -hmm. so um for me i love to bring the outside in so obviously yes. this help house plants kind of large but yes. you can do any size and it's a great way to kind of feel grounded in your space. Absolutely. Jordan, I think you have the house plants covered, right, think, over yeah, at home. I think you have one, that yeah. covered. So you have more than enough mood boosters. <laughs> um, you talked I about do. candles. Candles being really important as well. Set yeah. the mood with candles. Light it all up. Don't save it for, you know, a special occasion. Yeah. Just have fun with it and create a mood for yourself. Absolutely. And I want to come over here and talk about these oranges, too, because I had no idea that that was a mood booster. Oh my gosh, yes. The color orange just is so bright and mm -hmm. it instantly makes you, it energizes your brain and makes you excited for the day. I love that. I never knew that. I mean, I definitely love to eat oranges and they're good in a mimosa, but I didn't know that it was a mood <laughs> booster. So, and then let's talk about really quickly here about this tile, because Jordan mentioned this tile, just how, how unique and how beautiful that is. Oh, thank you so much. So my client actually chose this tile and I love because they are such vaulted ceilings mm -hmm. in this room. Um, you don't have to go all the way to the ceiling mm -hmm. for a backsplash. Obviously this does its job and more. Right. Um, it oh, packs wow. a style punch, but it also, if there's any splatter from cooking or uh, cutting right. your oranges, right. um, it, it covers it, so. Well, and I love too, because definitely, I mean, the tile goes to about right here, but this is where all the plates are, this is where the cups are, and then everything up here is more like it's decor, it's pieces like that, right? Yes, so it's yeah. functional and beautiful. That's amazing, well, thank you so much. So again, if people want you to do some interior decorating in their homes, and their businesses, and their pool house, how can they get in touch with you? Uh, follow on Instagram at Elizabeth C. Style, and my website is www.elizabethcstyle.com. Fantastic. And follow you on Instagram because um, right after the first segment, your phone was blowing up with new Instagram followers. <laughs> you were like, oh my gosh, this is incredible. I was like, look at this. Yeah, I know. That was so great. So again, but you you post all of your tips. You post a lot of the spaces that you do on your Instagram and on your website as well. You even do some home tours, right, of some of the rooms that you've done so people can really get an idea of the style that you, that you bring to them. Exactly. Yeah. I do a lot of behind the scenes too, so I show some of the nitty gritty of just a day in the life of interior designers. So. I love that. All right, so make sure you go follow her get in touch with her because again she can create this for you and this is so beautiful it's so bright i love it so much we'll send it on back to you guys in studio thank you yes a very inspiring spot she's got right there thanks kk thank